This segment is sponsored by GBMC Healthcare. Now, earlier in the show, you heard Traffic Jam Jimmy share his personal story with prostate cancer. Now, we want to get more people talking. Dr. Matthew Boyer with GBMC wants to share the importance of early detection. Hello. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Oh, thank you for being with us. Good morning, doctor. So who should undergo screening for prostate cancer and when should screening begin? Well, the biggest risk factor for prostate cancer is simply age. It's very uncommon in men under 40. It's also somewhat uncommon in men under 50. So most guidelines recommend starting around the age of 50 years old, possibly a little bit earlier for men in higher risk groups. How often should men be screened for prostate cancer? Generally, the recommendation is to screen every one to two years with a PSA blood test. Uh, the American Cancer Society breaks it down a little bit more based on what the PSA value is. And if it's below a certain level, maybe men can just have screening done every two years, or if it's above our level, to come back once a year for that PSA test. Now, are there any factors that can increase someone's chance of developing prostate cancer? Yes, there are. Um, so African Americans in general are at a higher risk of prostate cancer. They also tend to get prostate cancer at a younger age. Mm -hmm. and it tends to be a little bit more aggressive when it does uh, appear. Um, so most recommendations uh, would come in for African American men to start their screening at 45. Other big risk factor is just a family history of prostate cancer um, and also family history of other cancers like breast cancer or ovarian cancer in women. Um, and those, those men might be recommended to have uh, screening starting at 45 or eight, even age 40. Wow, so what can we do to motivate other people to you know, get screened? Well, I think the, the recommendations all come with a guideline to say, that this should be done in conjunction with your primary care doctor. Um, so it's important to have a good uh, relationship with a primary care doctor and have what they call shared decision making with them about when to start uh, prostate cancer screening and what the benefits are of it. Wonderful, so how can we find out more information about it? Uh, so there's a number of good websites. Uh, the American Cancer Society at cancer.org has a lot of great information. Certainly at GVMC, we have a number of websites available too. You can go to the radiation oncology website that I um, you know, work under. It's uh, gvmc.org uh, slash radiation dash oncology um, for more information. All right. Anything you want to add, doctor? So the important thing to know is that prostate cancer, I think, is a slow growing uh, condition mm -hmm. and there's many opportunities uh, for treatment, both um, surgery and radiation. And uh, in, in the end, it's also uh, ultimately a very curable disease. Oh, well, Dr. Boyer, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you.